Yeah! What up, y'all, and welcome back to another one. I wanted to open up the uh, video a little bit different today. I, th I think it's getting a little bit monotonous opening up the videos in the shop, so if you appreciate it, you know what to do. But we already got the spread set. It's uh, obviously still dark out, so I will show you that here in a little bit. But guess who we got with us yet again today? Oh, Bond's uh, daddy. You're making me feel special. I know, I'm giving you a whole intro oh, yeah. just for you, son. But check out Bond's daddy's hat. He's got that new khaki beanie from Ducks. Tell him where to pick it up, son. Link in the bio. That's all you need. <laughs> He's like, wait, 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 you're making me think too fast, Bob. Right. It's too early for this. It is too early for this. I'm fogging up like usual. We've been uh, working our bunions off. Uh, we put up 60 dozen decoys today. Silhouettes and socks only. We got the old mojo flags out, all six of them just a ripping. And the hide is one of the best hides of the season so far. I can't see, I'm fogging up again. One of the best hides, literally, that I've ever had. I'll show you the entire setup here in just a second. But I gotta get Fred rigged up, I gotta get his e-collar on, I gotta get his vest on, let's roll. Well, hi there, pretty boy. Look at Freddy, he is ready, I'm telling you. His concentration lately is just crazy when he gets in this blind. We've been doing a lot of work at home. I've uh, been doing like long periods of placing, uh, a lot of obedience, a lot of staying, sitting, not moving, you know what I mean? Trying to get him away from the breaking problem. I don't like it, you guys don't like it, it's not safe for him, it's not what he should be doing. Uh, but here is the spread, check it out. We have out 60 dozen and uh, they're all cellos and socks today. It is thick. Actually, we probably have enough time. Let's just walk on out there and take a gander. Don't be knocking down my decoys, Frig. Look at him. He's such a good boy. Here's our hide. You really can't see it right now, but hey, hey, Jordan. How you doing? How you doing? I'm present. Can't see much, uh, but we're on a fence line, like I said. We got the A-frames up, and it looks beautiful. And we're eh, 15 yards from the spread where it starts. And uh, check it out. So we have a south wind today. Boom, going that way. So the birds are gonna be coming this way, straight in our face. And uh, yesterday it said it was supposed to be like 15 or more. There's like barely a breath. It's six to seven mile an hour is what they're calling for this morning now. So this is what we have. Uh, I do my usual wide blob, mix everything nice, mix the socks, mix the silos, just evenly pretty much. Now on each end, I usually thicken it up, and then towards the back where the blind is, I thicken it up. And then out here where we want them to land, it's a little thinner. And we have mild, mild holes, so check out our kill holes here. I've been liking this little idea, so we have the spread drags out all the way over there. We have a kill hole here, a little peninsula, and then a nice kill hole here. And it wraps back around, that's where we are. This is where I think they're gonna do it the most. The wind is gonna shift a little southwest, so I made this left side a lot heavier with a place for him to sit down. You learn, you know what I mean? You learn, it ain't always right, but the more you do it, the more ideas you get and the better at it you get, you know what I mean? Always try something different, try something new until you figure something out that works. Stick to it and just perfect it, you know what I mean? Don't get a crazy new idea and say, we've never said this and, and, and just stick to what you know and perfect what you know. That's how your spreads are gonna be the best, I'm telling you. On a scale from one to 10, Bonzel, how good is the hunt gonna be? 12. 12? Yep, we always get these same answers from you young men. You know why? Why? Because you're here. Oh, that's what's up. <laughs> Brad said fake news. <laughs> uh, beautiful morning though, check out this sunrise. It's a beaut. Absolutely gorgeous sunrise we got going on today boys and gals shoot them oh well uh i clicked i didn't shoot that was awesome that was that was great gun is clean too i don't know what's going on with the gun i wonder if she's getting worn out because she has been clicking Fred, here come on let's go she's been clicking on me and i ain't been liking it she might be getting worn out on me you know after all of the thousands of rounds oh, yeah. and all the misses all the misses all them sky busts look at look at fred come on fred why are you struggling fred, bud fred's doing a good job right here got a band on it freddy huh is that why it's so heavy huh 
well i don't know what's going on on a few of the last hunts i've been blaming on my gun being dirty but the last two hunts it, i guess it didn't mess up yesterday pigeon hunting but um it's been clicking not a lot you know not a bunch but it's been clicking and i ain't been liking it she might just be getting worn out on me so might have to buy a new gun drop a comment down below what type of gun should i buy next i don't know if i'm gonna be able to get away from the old franc you know i don't know but let me know let me know what's your favorite gun what should bobby buy next well old bradley all the way on the right end smacked that single got the skunk out of the boat right after shooting light uh but that was the first shot and now we finally are seeing the first groups in the air so what time is it it is 7 30 so it's been shooting light for 20 25 minutes so about to heat up y'all oh boys get ready <laughs> Shoot him right there. Oh, that wasn't me. I that last uh, one. Yeah, that was you. You <laughs> shot that last one. That was nice. Check all them birds for bands. Those came from town, boys. Dead bird, come on. Look where all these dead landed. Right there, hey, right here. Look at them all up there. Oh, God. Fred, here, 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 here. Get in, get in, get in, get in. Get in. Oh, no, look at this hawk. Look at this hawk, he's gonna attack that bird. He's gonna attack. Oh, that would've been cool. Yeah, it would. <laughs> a hawk almost attacked, or one of the dead birds we got here. I'll be darn. Fred, dead bird. Good boy, here. Let's go. Come on, let's go. Come on, let's go. Good boy, here. Here, 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 here. Good boy, dude. Good boy, good boy. There we go. Uh, that was <laughs> that was beautiful. I don't know if it gets any better than that. I doubled on my last shot. I was just a hair high, and Brad smacked him. So I've shot two. Uh, what have you shot, Bonzel? I du I doubled too. I shot. Did you? One, my first shot I got missed. My second shot and the third shot I got one. Oh. So they were they were close. Yeah. They did it. Good boy, Fred. That's a good dog set. Well, I got the electric collar, the old shot collar on Fred yet again today. Uh, this is the fourth hunt, I believe, with him. Um, those are snows, boys. Yeah, they are. I will sky bust some snows. <laughs> hey, you want to call me sky bust? I got three and a half babies. Yeah, you, ha you have enough power behind that booty. right there oh nice One. nice oh he's a sailor Fred here that was a hard shot they flanked on us really fast on the left side or the right side over there they turned left fast they're like no nope. I couldn't even get a shot now guys just like that you guys seen me pull up right here but I just had my gun up waiting if they're going to come over me. There's no way I'm going to shoot over their head like that. So don't bust your buddy's ears. Oh, good lordy. Get ready, boys. Wow. Shoot him. Nice. Nice. I didn't even pull the trigger. Dude, you shot. So, dude, I pulled up. I was like, I'm going to let you shoot first. Yeah. Blap. You just smashed, just smashed him. Good, Fred. Here. Good boy. Look at that dog. That's my boy. Let's go, Fred. Here. Set my bird. Back. He got crushed. That might have been the one that you that you burned down, son. You're, that's your bird. These black clouds are doing good. 
Oh, I gave uh what do you got here? Show him. Good boy, look at him. He's like, here, dad, here. Fred still hasn't ever retrieved a band. Wouldn't that be awesome? I can't wait to the first banded bird he retrieves. But uh Austin absolutely smacked that bird. You gave me some shells today and these just <laughs> these are pounding them. <laughs> they do the good. trick. Yeah. They're gonna keep doing it. <laughs> shoots at first, what are you talking about? <laughs> we got a speck working here. Uh he's absolutely just loving it. Whoever shoots him first gets a prize. I'm not going to tell you what the prize is yet. You may or may not like it. I'm not going to shoot. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm filming. <laughs> He's like, I'm out. I'm out. Here he comes, boys. Ooh. Shoot him if you can, Jordan. I'll back you up. Okay, we can wait. Good call. Good call. <laughs> He's getting lower. <laughs> Yeah, oh, here we go. Here we go. Okay, this, this is our chance on our spec. All right, come on, guy. Get in. He's a young spec. He's not very smart. Yeah, no, he's... Listen to that squeak. If he comes over the top right here, smoke him. Smoke him, Jordan. He, he's real dead. Bang! That's a juvenile spec. Good boy, Fred. That is a juvenile spec. Good shooting on the right side, boys. Here, Fred. Here. Here, Fred. Here. Here, Fred, here. Oh, Jordan missed. Who shot him? Who gets a prize? Oh, it was oh, it was you, Preston. Clean all the birds now. That's a good one. Yeah, we will make you clean all the birds. Good boy, Fred. That's that's a good looking speck. Not really. It's a definite juvenile speck. Look, you don't have any bars or anything on him. Very young, very young speck. They're a squeaky bird. They make a squeaky sound, and the higher pitch. If they don't have bars on them, the higher pitch. Are, they're babies, you know. Uh, he's definitely a baby. Oh boys, let's smash him. Poor Jordan. He just went to go get a walker. And we got a group on the deck. Get ready. They're here, they're I'm here. Ready. No, they're already here, dude. Like, they're here, here. We're not calling again. See if they like it. No calling. I got their attention from about 100 yards out. And look at them. Shh. Good lord, guys. Shoot him. Oh, I got two. Oh, wow. Oh, geez. That was close. I didn't see that coming. My bad. <laughs> Good, Fred, here. Uh, that was beautiful. Yeah, look, that bird fell right there, dude. Yeah, I right, know. What are we having the blinds? Oh, he just plowed through the barbed wire fence. I hope it did not cut him. Uh, this fence right here, he just plowed through it. Oh, Fred. I'm sure he's cut. You need to stop, dude. He doesn't know any better. Stop. Stop. We hold that. Yep. I hope he didn't just jack himself all up. Come on, buddy. Here. Here, Fred. Come on. Here, right here. Here, buddy. Come on. Come on. Watch it. Good lord, guy. Hold on. Sit down. Sit. Okay, we got to check you. Check him for bands. Sit down. Let me check you. You plowed through that, dude. Golly. You okay? Let me see you. Let me see you. Let me see you. You okay? Let me look at you. Looks like he's all right. Oh, goodness. Sit. <laughs> I hope he didn't cut himself and I'm just not seeing it. He literally went boom and then ripped through it. Thank goodness for a vest, a good vest. Guarantee you that vest just saved him. Yeah, let's just get in, guys. Get in, get in. We got birds. We got birds. <laughs> what? Okay, they locked. All right. Birds are locked and loaded, boys. <laughs> Look at these three out front.
Shoot him! Shoot him! Oh my goodness! I didn't shoot anything. My gun clicked again. Nice! Yeah, you did. You killed something. Long shooter. Don't count me out. Woo! Ah, my gun clicked again. Something's wrong. Something is wrong Fred with the gun. Bob, Bob, Bob. Fred, hold on. Hold on. Fred, stop. Sit, 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 sit. I didn't even know you went back there again. Come on, buddy. Come on. Come on. Good boy. This fence is really... I was scared about this fence when uh, I found out where we were going to be sitting in the field. But that bird right there about smoked me. That was close. That was close. But if you're liking the video, you know what to do. Smash that thumbs up button. Come on! Oh, well. I know the shot cam footage is good. It'd be better if my gun wouldn't click. I don't know. I have no idea what's wrong with my gun. But it's clicking a bunch. Like a lot. A bunch. You shoot him. Oh, it's gonna be a hard shot. Nice shot, Brad. Was that Preston, Bradley? Preston. That was yeah. Preston. Fred is on the run. Look at that. He is going Go, hard. Go. Good try, Keep man. going, buddy. Boom, that's yeah. a long one. Good deal. He just chased him a good hundred yards. Good, Fred, here. Let's go. Good boy. Shoot him up top. Nice. I knew we could at least pluck one off of it. Might as well. I'm not afraid. Mm -mm. I ain't scared. I ain't scared. Good, Fred. Look at that boy right there. Come on, boy. Here. Woo. Well, my mouth is all frozen up on me from calling so much. If I don't give it a break, it's like, if I don't give my mouth a break and like let it recoup, my calling gets really bad. I'm already a bad caller as it is, so I'm a sky buster. I'm a bad caller. What else am I, Bonzel? Uh, an amateur hunter. Amateur pigeon hunter. Yeah. For sure, you are too, though. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. We're proud of that one, though, for sure. We're proud of that one. Oh, golly. Shoot those birds. Oh, they went right. Nice! Nice! Woo! They were on the right side. I couldn't shoot them. Good shooting, boys. They were close. Fred, dead bird! Jordan just smashed the snow. Uh-oh. Oh my God, he's just demolishing the spread. Fred, here. Good, come on. Oh, juvenile, juvie. Look at the gray on that bird. Dirty. Dirty birds. Dumb and dirty. There are so many juvie snows, it's crazy. Well, that's what we need. We need the, we need the snows. Uh, check it out though. Look at the back of that. Juvies. You wouldn't think he's a juvie because how big he is, but that is a, uh, Lesser snow goose, but it's gray. It's a juvie. That's your bird, Jordan. I finally killed a juvie. <laughs> oh, I mount him even oh, though his neck is all broken. Back. Well, uh, Fred, he just got done with another really, really, really long retrieve. He's done probably uh, two of his longest. Those are specs. Well, well, well. Uh, we're, we're limited, by the way, on Canada's. Everybody has their six. We're done. Uh, so we're gonna see if we can decoy some specs and maybe get another snow or two down so but Fred has done two of the longest retrieves he's ever done today he's really killing it super proud of him uh, the fence though the barbed wire fence he's got to learn does a dog really learn though when their adrenaline's going and they're chasing a downed goose I don't know give me a, give me a tip or two if you have any for training dogs to be aware of uh, barbed wire fences I know that might be a far shot you know what I mean might be out here just crying for help for no reason but he <laughs> nailed that thing he, he just boom nailed it and ripped right through it he's not hurting he's all right him a good boy I'm proud of him man from a dog that was skin and bones with parvo this came a long ways Oh, Freddy boy, look at him. Ooh, look what I got you. Little treats for Freddy. He is a good boy. You deserve some treats, buddy. Looks like I had a major casualty of some sort or something. My goodness. Why aren't you bloody, dude? 
because I have headshots. Oh, you do headshots and they in arteries. Ah, oh, yeah. yeah. Brain shots only, yeah. huh? We know. We know, Bond's daddy. We know. Holy smokes, look at these birds. Okay, the specs are those four behind them. Yep. These yeah, guys. these two specs. Shoot those two specs. Oh my God, that one is so yes! Bad. One down, baby. There, Fred's got him. Oh, that wasn't the bar. That other one was nice. Shoot. These two were spec two. down, baby. Spec Fox down. Fox. And he and Fred is on a long retrieve. Look oh, at him. Oh, he's get him, get boy. This is his third long retrieve of the day. He's just killing it, man. Come on, Fred. Yeah. Good boy, here, buddy. There we go. Look at that speck. Holy smokes, what a beaut. That's a good looking bird right there, boys. Woo! Shoo! <laughs> yeah, shoo! I, I can't steal. <laughs> That's Flair's deal. That's y'all's deal. That's man. why I say it. <laughs> shoo! Shoo! I'm allowed to. Oh, Freddy. He's, oh, he's doing it. I like the one where Flair went, shoo! <laughs> yeah, he gets over the top with yeah. it. Look at this bird landing. Bo oh, up, yep, up. Yep. Which? Where do you want to sit, bud? Come on. Pick a spot. Pick a spot. Any spot. Come on. Oh, he's gonna come right over. Hey, see you, see you, buddy. Shoot him, Preston. Any specs in here, boys? No specs. They're in this group right here. I can hear them. It's the groups I don't like us. Look at this guy. He's still looking for a spot to land. Up, 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 up. Dude, just pick a spot, man. Any spot. Yeah, bro, it's too tight. Loosen up this spread. We do have it pretty tight. Uh, this is beautiful. What a beautiful morning, though. Oh, Frederick, look at him just watching birds, being a good boy, not breaking the old shot collar. It's doing him good. I've hit him. I've hit him a couple times with it today. And he shaped right up. Check out this little group of birds, fresh birds that arrived. Too bad we're limited on Canada's. We are done. Look at them. We got Brad, Brad, and Preston down there. Jamie. All of them just clicking away. It's going to be a good morning for photos because when you finish early like this, let the birds work, calm a little bit, see how they respond, maybe learn something and get some good footage. You know what I mean? Another group checking us out. What do you think, Bonds? You over there snapping? You, who are you snapping now? Uh, that is confidential information. Everyone. Huh? That is confidential information. <laughs> That's what I figured you'd say. <laughs> oh, my. This is beautiful, boy. Oh, look at this loner here. Hey, buddy, where are you going? I think he had a band. Yeah, you're out of your mind. Bonzo, don't be messing with me, all right? You get me all excited over here for nothing. <sighs> well, we are picked up and cleaning up here. Check out them wads. That's a uh, black cloud wad there. Uh, we have a high, high, high concentration of wads. Literally right where the kill hole was. So that's all we're doing now is picking up wads. Uh, I can I can tell you if you guys walk out here while you're picking up decoys and there's ever a time like geez What are all these clear white things on the ground? They're not feathers. They're wads. They're plastic wads Just everybody gather up after you're done picking up decoys walk around and pick up your wads just like this here Look at this Seriously guys, it's for the farmer. It's for nature Just do it clean up your mess as good as you can, you know try to leave it better than when you got here. You know what I'm saying? It's smart. It's respectful. It's good hunting ethics. It's being a responsible hunter, uh, not only for the landowner, but for the environment, you know? What all you got here? What'd you uh, just find out? These are speed shock wads. Yep. These are the flight control black cloud wads. Yep. These go 20 feet further. Yeah, <laughs> I know. I was it's vlogging and I'm walking. I'm like, why is there so many black ones way out here? Those flight control wads and those black cloud shells, they go far. How many yards were most of them from the blind, you think? 
I mean, that's every bit at of, least well, at least 25, 30 minimum. Every bit, yeah. minimum. And that's without a high wind today. You can imagine the winds out our back, like it always is. You can imagine if it was a 30 mile an hour wind or a 20, our wads would literally be 80 yards away or farther. Well, we are done. We're all packed up here. Look at that trailer. Look at it. Oh, it's good looking. Except for that guy right there. But 34 lessers today, two specks, one snow. Now, guys, uh, I filmed and I put it on my Instagram. If you have not followed me on Instagram, follow me right here. I put a ton of lessers, decoying, landing in our spread. So you might ask, why did you stop too short? We could have shot the two very, very easily, multiple different times, guys. But earlier in the morning, we got into some good groups. I always preach, if it's a good hunt, if you have fun, I personally, like in this situation, I like to stop short a couple birds. Now, Bond's daddy shot five and Brad shot five. And they were like, Bob, I'm okay with stopping. Sometimes you gotta do it. You don't, yeah. want, to, you don't want to lose birds. You just want it. Yeah, you want to be safe, right? Filming on the gram. I wanted so, to see you shoot. Yeah, you want to see me? Yeah, it took a little longer for you. Right. To your six. <laughs> but guys, not all the time do you have to hit the nail on the head. Be safe sometimes. Like I said, early morning we got into some really good groups uh, and we had a couple walkers that we had to run and go get. So I always like to leave a little bit of room. <laughs> Stay legal, guys. Keep it legal. Uh, just think ahead. What so I asked you when we were rolling, we were at this point earlier. This is where we were in the truck. Oh, yeah, yeah. And I asked you one out of ten, how's it gonna go? And what'd you I say? I said 12. 12. That was you're pretty accurate. I would say it was a great hunt. The birds were decoying so close. Yeah, that was that. And, and I because think, the hide was, yeah, the hide was really good. We almost got hit by three geese today. Yeah, that last one it scared you. I didn't even see it coming. <laughs> I mean, it would have smoked yeah. me. That's one thing is uh, I, there was a couple times where I wasn't paying attention and those birds literally fell right at our feet. That last one could have smacked me in the head and I wouldn't even know what it was that hit me. Awesome hunt. Awesome hunt. A uh, few tips for today though that uh, I can pass on to you guys. Today, low, low, low wind. We had six to seven mile an hour. It was barely a breath. It was barely enough to just like barely shake the sock you know what I mean so tip number one when uh, you have low low wind situations low wind get out of them decoys don't be laying in them get out let the decoys do their work second tip add some motion you now you don't need a wing flapper and all that jazz just something that spins something that gyrates the uh, mojo I gotta say the mojo mini flags they have worked uh, more than a handful of times in that identical situation with no wind. You spread them out through the, through the spread and they're magical, I'm telling you. Third tip, third and final tip is the hide situation. Guys, you can hide on a fence, you can hide on a brush line, you can hide on a tree row. I recommend, if you do have a choice, don't hide on a tree row or around tall structure. It's a lot better to hide on a fence and just use evergreens. If your state has a lot of evergreens in your fields, Use evergreens. Blind your laydown blinds up with evergreens. Try something new. Evergreens, it's a natural color. They don't shine, they blend down. Well, back home here, and I just got done editing this video and I'm like, I didn't even do an outro. I'm not gonna take any more of your time. I'm gonna make this short. This was a long video for one reason. It was an awesome hunt. The geese did it really well. They landed in the decoys. They were feet down. We were taking close shots. Now there were a few pokes, yes, but we downed those high pokes. You know what I'm saying? But guys, I just want to tell you to stick around for the next video. We shot a band. I'm not going to tell you what type of band it was. If you do follow me on Instagram, like I've been telling you in this video, you would have already known. But make sure you subscribe if you haven't. Hit that little notification bell down there because it will tell you when your boy uploads. And if you guys want to support the channel, you know what to do. Go down in the description. Hit the Ducks Waterfowl links for the hoodies, those thermal sweats, or any of our hats. Guys, I appreciate you guys being here, but until next time. Peace!